All right, next we're gonna look at rotating a point 180 degrees. I decided to start this out by just giving you the steps, all right? Um, but we'll go back to this as we read the example. So this is how to rotate a point 180 degrees. If you think about a circle, let me go ahead and just put a new slide on here real quick so I can show you. You know, it doesn't matter which way you go 180 degrees on a circle, you're gonna get up, you're gonna end up at the same point. So let's just pick some random point here. Let's say we start right here, okay? You know, if, if I go 180 degrees this way, that's a big line, but if I go 180 degrees this way, I'm gonna end up there, right? If I go 180 degrees the other way, it doesn't matter, I'm gonna end up at exactly the same point right here. So it won't matter clockwise or counterclockwise when going 180 degrees. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at this example we're going to rotate, uh, excuse me one second, okay, we're going to rotate this red point 180 degrees. So first of all, let's go ahead and make sure we follow the steps for rotating this. It's important to go ahead and label the point like we did before. So what is the value of this point? Well, it looks like it's 4 comma 3, okay? So I'm just going to label that point 4 comma 3. And I'm going to do it on my step page as well so we can get the right answer. Okay, now let's read this step carefully together. Again, this is for rotating a point 180 degrees either way. We're going to change the sign of the x and y values. We're not flipping them like we did with 90 degrees. We're just changing the sign of both of these. So the 4 is going to become negative 4, and the 3 is going to become negative 3. Again, if these values were already negative, then we'd make them both positive. So this is actually our new point, and we're going to go ahead for step 3 and plot that point. So negative 4, negative 3 is right here with this blue point. And you can quickly see that we've went 180 degrees around the circle. The circle goes off the page, but you can see that you've gone exactly 180 degrees from where you started. Okay, so it's um, that's it for rotating a point 180 degrees. Just flip the sign of both the x and the y. Our new point then would be negative 4, negative 3, as we mentioned before. Real easy for rotating a point 180 degrees. If you have any other questions about this example, let me know.